conventional studio, a site is identified, um, a team of both professors and students move out to uh, go and understand the site, pick out details, dynamics about the site, be they challenges, opportunities, potentials in the site, come back to class, analyze that, come up with solutions. You could very easily do that without the involvement of people who live on that site. Many of the professors working in the Department of Urban and Regional Planning have practiced before and they know and value the importance of working with communities, working with leaders and working with other influential actors within the settlements if you want to come up with a realistic plan. So the studio that is now currently being conducted between uh, Mungano and the universities within the country and outside the country follows the principles of valuing the potential and energy and experience information that we have from people living within the settlements. In one way, this is bringing the settlements to the universities and the universities to the settlements. So this studio approach allows the universities, again, to get a front seat in the settlements and allows the settlements to have a front seat real one-on-one -on -one engagement with the professionals, with the planning schools, either from Kenya or out of Kenya. So that principle is what forms the basis of the Mungano and University Initiative and, you know, having the studios. Um, we have recent funding as Mungano and the University of Nairobi, Department of Urban Planning, including the Center for Urban Research and Innovations, by funding by um, IDRC Canada. And the same approach that we use in the studio is being applied to go through uh, a studio process to understand dynamics on land ownership, access to infrastructure, governance and justice in the settlements. So we allow, we allow communities to play a big role where we will not necessarily record but where we will experience and see things through their own lens and it is for us to interpret those and make meaning out of those experiences and I, I can assure you um, the next the next phase of upgrading in this country will be very interesting because it will be informed a lot by what we see and know and has been influenced or contributed by the communities. This is the real studio now that we have.